Hi, my name is Martin and this is The Chariot. Let's get started by setting it up on its props. All you need to do is pull the spring-loaded pin and it locks securely in place. As you can see, the three-point design is very stable. Next, we flick open the drop locks and lower the ramp down. We will secure the wheelchair to four anchor points that can swivel to fit different wheelchairs. It is easy to roll on the wheelchair and connect it to the four tie downs. The front two are fixed but can be adjusted by buckles. The rear two are crossed over and tightened down. It certainly provides a very secure fit. Next, we close up the ramp, securing it with the drop locks. To improve the visibility of the chariot, we clip on two LED lights. The chariot connects to the bike in one smooth motion using the spring-loaded pin. The housing is out of the way when using the bike separately and it will also work with most other bikes. Safety is a very important part for me and that's why I added a safety chain as a backup just in case. I have created my very own version of a universal joint that not only allows a wide range of movement horizontally but vertically as well. Let's take it off the props and get going. All in all it only takes a couple of minutes to set up. Now that's sorted, let's go for a ride. On the 3rd of October, my client's daughter, Megan, whom I was making the chariot for, passed away suddenly and unexpectedly. I was devastated at the loss of such an amazing little 13-year-old girl who loved the rough rides in her wheelchair. I was near the completion of the project and decided from there onwards I would do my utmost to complete the chariot to the best of my ability in loving memory of her. I'd like to say a big thank you to Gavin Williams, design engineer at Avanti Bikes. You have helped me tremendously to refine the chariot and make it what it is today. To Gay Watson from Future in Tech, thank you for facilitating the meetings with Gavin. Without your involvement, I would not have had the great influence that Gavin has been. Next, I'd like to thank Stainless Bending, located in Penrose. You guys were eager to help me out to get those perfectly smooth curves in my frame that I could not otherwise accomplish due to the limitations of machinery available. Also, thank you to Perry Metal Protection in Rosebank for galvanizing my frame free of charge. It has left a durable finish that ensures my frame stands the test of time. Most importantly, thank you Mr. Achari. You were my first technology teacher at Botany and have brought me through the years to where I am today. I believe that you have pushed me to think creatively and complete my projects to, the, to a level that I never knew I could reach. Lastly, I'd not only like to thank Mr. Clark, but his entire family, who despite their enormous loss, have been willing and supportive. So now, we are on the hunt to find a family that would love and cherish Megan's chariot as much as she would have. Thank you.